What would the 10-year real estate professional Jocelyn say to the young Jocelyn? We're gonna talk about that on today's episode. This year marks 10 years in the business for myself as a real estate professional. So I thought about it. What would I tell my young self? The first thing I would tell to my young self is don't ever give up. In this business, there are so many ups and downs. So consistency truly matters. And I would say to myself, Jocelyn, from your first year and beyond, don't ever give up because persistence is everything. The next thing I would tell myself is find a mentor. I tended to learn everything the hard way. I watched a lot of YouTube videos and I figured I could just figure it out myself. But if I were to go back, I would say to my young self, find somebody that you can learn from and grow with and really learn the business from somebody who is experienced. I remember when I first started, it was probably my first six months in the business, I went up to the top producing agent in my office and I said to her, what does it take to be a top producer and be in your shoes. She tapped on my shoulder and she said, Jocelyn, 25 years in the business. And I looked at her and I wasn't even 25 years old yet. And I said, I'm gonna do it in five. And I did, but I would still find myself a mentor. I started a team in 2016. My first hire was a buyer's agent. I was getting so many leads, buyers and sellers, I just couldn't service them. So that was my first hire. Looking back, if I were to speak to my young self, I would have said, hire a support staff, an assistant, a transaction coordinator, marketing person, somebody that could help me on the back end grow. That would definitely be probably the most important thing I would tell my young self. Be patient, young Jocelyn. Be patient with myself, with clients. Sometimes I tend to be a little impatient. I want things right away. I like things done one, two, three, as soon as possible. But I've learned to tell my young self, and still till today I tell myself, be patient with yourself and with clients. The last thing I would tell myself as young Jocelyn is to buy more real estate. That's one of the things I did not do. I helped so many people make a lot of money, invest in properties, flip properties, but I never got into it myself. So that's what I would tell my young self, buy more properties. Do you have anything inspiring or motivating that you would tell your younger self? Put it in the comments below because maybe there's something that I forgot to tell myself. We'll see you next time on Joy and Jocelyn.